In this problem, we're asked to simplify i raised to the power of 63. Well, when you take i and raise it to any power, you always end up with one of four choices. There's a pattern that repeats. It starts with i itself, and then i squared is negative 1, i cubed is negative i, and i fourth is 1. And then that pattern repeats. If you look at it in the circle over here, the pattern begins with i, i squared is negative 1, i cubed is negative i, and i fourth is 1. So if we put that pattern down below, again, i to the first power is i, and i squared is negative 1. i cubed actually has to be a combination of i squared times i, so it makes sense that that would be negative 1 times i or negative i. And i to the fourth should be i squared times i squared. Well, negative 1 times negative 1 is positive 1. Now we just repeat that pattern. So i to the fifth should be i. i to the uh, sixth power should be negative 1. i to the seventh power should be negative i. And then finally, i to the eighth is 1. And then the pattern begins again. i to the ninth should be back to um, i. So the pattern is 1, 2, 3, and 4. Now when you have a really large power of i, you don't want to have to repeat this whole thing all the way up to 63. So what we can do is I'm going to show you an example with i to the ninth. Because the pattern repeats every 4, if you take the exponent and divide by 4, the number that you want in the pattern will be the remainder. So if I take 9 and divide by 4, again, because the, the pattern occurs every fourth time, uh, let's see, 4 will go into 9 uh, two times with a remainder of 1. So this remainder of 1 tells me that I want the first one in the pattern. And the first one in the pattern is i. And sure enough, i to the ninth is i. So if I have 63 then, I'm going to take 63 and divide by 4. That will tell me which one in the pattern I want. Let's see, 4 goes into 6 one time. The remainder of 2, carry down to 3. 5 times 4 is 20, so I find out that my remainder is 3. So I want the third one in the pattern. The third one in the pattern is negative i. So in WAMAP, I would choose negative i.